in order. Do you think about that? Do you wonder about that? Do you pause to ask that question, is my life in order? <clears throat> well, these days we are more likely to think in terms of being organized or getting organized. And of course the two principles are related. But I've had a, a certain insight recently that when uh, areas of my life are in order, then there's a certain peaceful uh, quality to that, that, that peaceful quality that says I'm between struggles right now. Um, so <clears throat> having your one's life in order could be anything from making your bed in the morning and picking up a few things on your way out, uh, knowing that when you return later in the day that 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 room is in order and that there's a certain peaceful quality to that order. We live in a very hectic society in which uh, people have lots of different things going on and I've even heard people say, yeah, I thrive on hectic. I'm thinking, well, you know, let's challenge that belief. Are you really thriving if life is hectic? You know, d does hectic mean that everything is in order? Probably not. And it probably represents a degree of disorganization. Um, part of my story is that about 12 years ago, I realized that I had way too many things going on. And uh, I decided to do a complete reset. <clears throat> so I, I, I say that I sold everything, but the children, uh, in fact, that was close to being true. The children and a few pieces of family furniture um, my car was paid for, um, but I sold uh, a mini farm with a bunch of farm animals and uh, got out from under uh, a heavy mortgage <clears throat> and got down to the point where I was debt free. I was leasing a small house. It felt a little beneath me uh, in that context of my being, you know, a successful physician. But the point is that that. Uh, decision to, to be modest, to be humble, uh, <clears throat> reset everything. And, uh, and, and so I went from a life that was hectic and out of order in the sense that uh, I wasn't thriving in any one area of my life. <clears throat> so since then, life has been much more manageable and therefore it has been easier to keep things organized or again, to keep things in order. So the, the point of this discussion is to encourage you, number one, to ask that question, am I happy? Secondly, if I'm not happy, when will I be happy? Because this hectic, anxious lifestyle that I'm living in which I'm overscheduled and overwhelmed, um, it's not a happy situation and, and so when will you be happy? So you'll be happy when things are organized and manageable and then if you go to that next level of things are not just organized but they are in order, it sounds ideal uh, and perhaps it is, but it's a great thought that I am happiest when things are in order. <clears throat>